guys welcome back to another vlogmas so today's video is gonna be what is in my bag you guys have been requesting this so much recently i literally get a message every single day saying when are you uploading this video this video reminds me so much of when i first started watching youtube it was all about what's in my purse and just the most like simple makeup tutorials so this is my bag and it's from misguided it reminds me so much of the dior saddle bag which is why i got it i love the dior bag but it's so expensive i i don't think i'll ever own that but um yeah this is very similar to it just like the style and the look of it and it does have that short handle which i love i don't have any bags like this i've been carrying this bag pretty much every day and i really like it i get so many compliments on it because it is so different and it does kind of have like a gloss to it which i don't really love but honestly this bag is really affordable it looks small but it actually carries so much like mine's pretty full right now oh that scared me um <laughs> looks pretty small but it carries a lot this probably carries more than any of my other bags i have all small bags like all cross bodies and shoulder bags i don't really carry a lot in my bag so this is honestly good enough for me but yeah let's get into it so first obviously is my phone which <laughs> i just posted a boomerang but um I have the iPhone 11 Pro Max in the gray color, and I love this phone. I do miss my 8 Plus, I'm not gonna lie. A lot of you guys asked me about my screensaver, and honestly, I think I got it off Pinterest. I don't know what I typed, but I would go through my screenshots and try to find it for you guys. I have so many photos, like, let me just see. Hello? Sometimes this does not work. I have 23,000 photos in my recents and 9,000 of those are screenshots. I literally, if I see something I like, I'll screenshot it and I never go back to it. So I don't know why I do that. My case is from Casemate. It's just a clear case. I actually just got a new phone case on Black Friday, but it's not going to come in for probably another two weeks, but it's a really cute and I'll show you guys in a vlog. And then my keys I have on this Louis Vuitton 6 key holder. I've had this for a while now. I'm sure you guys have seen it in my other bag videos. This is probably like my most used designer item. And it's so practical. I literally have my keys in here and my cards in this slot. Um, if you don't put your cards in here, you can... Uh, put your key down and like close it so it doesn't scratch your bag which is mainly why I got it but it's actually so practical for my cards and I can just run out the house with these two and I'm good to go honestly most days that's what I do on this I have my car key obviously I drive a BMW I'll leave a link to my video when I got my car if you guys want to see that and then just like my mail key and my house key and stuff and all my cards so this is so practical I love this I also get a lot of compliments on that because a lot of people have the key pouch, which to be honest, I do want in the monogram. But it's sold out everywhere. It's sold out online. It's sold out in all the stores because of the holidays. So yeah, but for now, I love that and I use it every single day. Um, and then I have moist, flushable wipes, you know, just, just in case. It's nice to have these um you just never know when you're gonna need one so i'm such a clean freak like i hate dirtiness in general so yeah those are necessary i have some cash i never have cash on me um what the heck is in here oh <laughs> i never have cash on me i always use my cards but anytime i get ones i keep um just to save and i don't know i just like I like having ones so i guess <laughs> This is a Bath & Body Works um, scent portable. This is the pumpkin cupcake. I actually have the vent, which is really cute. But I put it in my purse to remember to put it in my car. But obviously, I haven't done that. And it's been in here for a minute. I have um, turquoise waters, which is a summer scent. I need to go buy like winter ones because these are like fall ones and I don't want to use those. I have some hand sanitizer, of course, because, you know, if you go eat out, if any, just any time, you need hand sanitizer. Like I said, I'm a clean freak. I always pull this out, like, random times in the day, even when, you know, I probably don't really need it. But, yeah, this smells really good, too. It's from Target. I have some oil blotting sheets from Clean and Clear. Honestly, don't use these. I think I found these in my room and was like, let me just throw it in my bag. I have some receipts, um, Trader Joe's, 
and nectar when I went to get green juices. I need to keep those receipts. I have a vlog on my Trader Joe's haul and the juices if you guys want to see that. I'll also link that. I have my AirPods, which to be honest, I never really use. I really wanted them and then I just didn't really use them. I feel like I use them more for traveling purposes, but I bought these mostly for editing, but um, it's been very peaceful at my house, so I don't need them. But I got this case off of Amazon. I really like it. It's like a pale yellow and it's silicone. These aren't the new ones, by the way. I think this is like the second generation, which they're really not different from the first. I have some floss. I think I got this at the dentist. They gave this to me. I have to have floss on me at all times. If something's in my teeth, I cannot function. Like, I'll just freak out. So I always have floss on me. If you don't floss, you need to, okay? It's so much better for you. It's better for your teeth. You look better. There's so many benefits. Um, the last things I have are just a bunch of lip products. I don't like to retouch my makeup. The only thing I retouch is my powder and my lips. I usually have the Laura Mercier powder um, with me, the mini one, but I ran out of it, so I don't have that at the moment. But a bunch of lip products. I usually just put whatever one I'm wearing and throw it in my bag. This isn't what I'm wearing. This must be from the last time, but... Um, I have this Milani Lip Liner in Spice. This is very similar to like Max or just like a mauve color. And I like to use like cheaper lip products in my bag because someone stole my bag. I won't be that sad. Um, this one's Nude Truffle by NYX. This is another one of my favorites. Um, this is my favorite lip gloss of all time. It's the Kevin Aquan Glass Glow Lip. I will leave links in the description box for you guys. But this is a must have. Like, I need to buy, like, 10 of these because I love it. And then NYX Butter Gloss in Madeline. I like this one when I'm not wearing makeup or when I just want a sheer lip, but I don't want it to be, like, clear. I want a little bit of color. This is my favorite for that. It's also really moisturizing. And then it does have this little zip compartment, and I usually have, like, a feminine product in there, but I've been really good with tracking that stuff, so don't really need to have one. Or when it's that time, I usually will put one in here, but... Yeah, that is my bag. You guys see it fits quite a bit of stuff. Um, literally fits everything you need. This video went by so fast. Like I said, I don't carry a lot of stuff. I really want the Neverfull Toe. I feel like I'm the only girl in the world that doesn't have that yet. And that's the first bag I ever wanted. But I don't know if I'd use it to its full potential because I don't carry a lot of stuff. Maybe if I had a bigger bag, I would just throw a bunch of stuff in there. Eventually, I will get that bag maybe around my birthday. Um, I've already planned two trips. Well, only one's official. But I'm planning two trips for my birthday. I didn't travel at all this year, you guys. In 2019, I only went to Seattle which is only three hours away. So it's definitely one of my goals for 2020. And yeah, the two places I'm planning, one of them I've already been to, kind of, but I haven't really gone around there yet. So I want to go there. And then the other place I went to when I was a kid, but it's not fun when you're a kid. I think you can guess where I'm going. I already have so much exciting stuff coming in the new year. I really cannot wait. I can't believe it's 2020. Like... That is the most, like, with just me saying that number is a little scary, you know, 2020. That's so crazy. Like, when you're in high school and you think, like, oh, I'm graduating in this year, and then I'm going to college, I'm graduating in this year, and it seems like forever, but then you hear this type of number and you're like... But yeah, that is it for this video. Today's shout-out is going to my friend Maria. She commented quoting me and what I said in my video about Justin Bieber. Only a couple of my friends actually watch my YouTube videos and like comment and like them and all that. And she's one of them. So I love you and I miss you. We need to do a video together. She actually has a YouTube channel. So go subscribe to it. I will leave a link in the description box. She's also doing Vlogmas and her family is the cutest. If you guys would like a shout out, all you have to do is comment below, like this video and subscribe and turn on your post notifications and I'll be picking a shout out every single video so yeah i love you guys and i'll see you guys tomorrow bye Mwah.